Hi guys and welcome back to my channel or if you're new here, hi my name is Emily, I'm 36 years old and I live in Sweden. Welcome to my little corner of the internet where I talk mostly beauty, uh, but not that often because life. In today's video, as you see from the title, I'm going to show you my latest purchases. So this is like a August haul. I'm waiting for two more items to come in because I don't know what happened to me, uh, uh, but I can do a separate video of those. Um, so today I have stuff from Kix, I have hair care and then I have uh, makeup and then I have perfumes and then I have a yes style order. So let's start out with the Kix one. So if you want to see uh, my latest purchases then please keep watching. Uh, if you can hear anything my, my daughter is playing in, the, uh, playing in the background. Okay so I bought this. This is the R Co Turntable Curl, Curl Defining Cream. I used this once. Uh, and uh, I like it. Um, they had 25% 20, 20 off of hair care. And then I bought the Orenco Aircraft Pomade Mousse. I have this in a large bottle. Um, I have half of it left, so I'm not really sure why I bought this. But this is good. It's a good travel size if I want to take it to work or gym or something. Um, this is a mousse that you can like deactivate, so it doesn't like. Now my hair really needs a shower, but my curl is from several days ago and I've had it in a bun the last two days. But yeah, you can like form your hair with this. And then I bought the R&Co Outer, Spa Outer Space Flexible Hairspray. Um, it's okay. I have nothing more to say than that. Uh, then let's take this. This is the LH Cosmetics Matte Attack Primer um, and I bought this because I've been struggling to keep my makeup on on my chin. It gets really oily there and really like mm. um, so I asked in a Facebook group and they recommended this or my friend recommended this uh, but now I've actually been using the e.l.f. Power Grip Primer, the pink one that I bought in the US and it's really good. Um, but I'm looking forward to trying that. And uh, then I have two skincare items from Geek and Gorgeous. I have the 101 A game. This is a 0 0.05, 0 0.05 retinol serum. Um, this is like my fourth bottle. I love this. And then from Geek and Gorgeous, I also bought the C Glow 15% vitamin C serum. Um, I remember I've used this once before, I think. I think I used the whole bottle up. I do, I do really like it. Okay, then I bought these two. These are the latest uh, releases from Kayali. Um, so let's start with this yellow one uh, that I have used a little bit. It looks like this. This is the Kayali Capri in a Bottle Lemon Sugar. Uh, key notes are lemon, sugar, freesia, raspberry, vanilla, and musk. And this smells like nothing I've ever smelled, actually. This is like a sweet citrus cake with some, like, vanilla, with some vanilla in it. Uh, I absolutely love this. And then I bought um, this one that I haven't used that much. It's the Kayali again, Maui in a bottle, sweet banana. And the keynotes are sweet banana, pear, coconut cream, jasmine, sandalwood, and vanilla. And this smells more like a coconut scent for me. Um, yeah, mostly coconut. I do smell a little bit of banana, but not like the ripe yellow banana, more like the green banana that you can eat in food. Like, I don't know, is it called? I don't know what it's called in English, but. I guess you know what I mean. Uh, but this also smells amazing. So I bought that. And then... Now I can get rid of this. And then from from a friend I got uh, 10 milliliters of the Aqualina. Sorry, I got interrupted by my daughter. Um, so a friend sent me 10 milliliters of the Aqualina Pink Sugar. Um, this on my skin smells straight up licorice. Um, no, I'm glad I didn't buy that. Let me tell you that. 
Then I actually bought three five milliliters of Fleur fragrances. I regret not buying uh, the brand in the US. Um, oh God, my hair. Um, I regret not buying. I regret not buying this brand in the US. I bought the Mango Mood, the Vanilla Skin, and the Amber Haze. Um, I just like worn them on my arms when I got them. And uh, I do really like them. As I said, I regret not buying the actual, uh, the actual brand in the US. Okay, uh, let's, uh, let's move on with Yes Style. Uh, when I made an order, it was like a school school sale, a starting school sale. Um, okay, so how do I do this without knocking anything? So I do that anyway. Okay. Cool. Uh, this is a repurchase. This is the Rovecting Gentle Cleansing Gel. Uh, it used to come in another bottle, uh, but this is one of my favorite cleansers. I uh, can actually really recommend. So happy I have that again. Hmm. <laughs> Sticking to the cleanser bit, I have the Beauty of Joseon Radiance Cleansing Balm. I've heard so good, much good stuff about this, so I had to buy, buy it. Uh, I haven't opened it yet, but can you remove this? No. It's a cleansing balm. Can't wait to try that. Getting a package from YesStyle is like getting a Christmas present. Um, <laughs> then about the Madagascar Centella Ampule, amp ampule from Skin1004. Never tried this brand, or never tried an ampule before. I'm not even sure in where in the actual skincare regime it's supposed to be, but it looks like this. Mm. Made with pure centella from Madagascar. Um, and this is supposed to... Let me... No, I cannot Google it because I'm filming on my phone. Uh, I do remember this being like a calming thing because it has centella in it. Uh, actually, I'm going to keep it in that. Mm -hmm. That was an ample. Um, then I bought the Tear Tear, Tear Milky Skin Toner. Uh, it contains chamomile extract and rice bran extract that make, that make moist and smooth. Um, it just looks like this. It's a milky consistency. Um, haven't tried the brand. Looking forward to trying it. Uh, then I have the I'm from Fig Boosting Essence. I bought the smaller size because I'm not sure if my skin will like it, uh, but I'm curious. Um, I've had the I'm from Rice toner before and I liked that, so I like the brand. Uh, really looking forward to trying that as well. Uh, then I just started to watch a Swedish girl. She speaks Swedish on her videos. She's, she does videos about K-beauty. And K skincare, I guess. Uh, and she used toner pads, and I've never done that. So I bought two that she talked about. So I bought the Numbersin 5 Plus Vitamin and Niacinamide Concentrated Pad. Um, so it looks like this. It is a, it's a nice looking box, and um, as you can see, the liquid is. Here. It looks really good. I'm really looking forward to trying that. I'm actually going to set this in my bathroom cabinet. And for the millionth of times today, millionth time today, I've, my daughter came in here. Um, I was talking about this is the carrot calming water pad from Skin Food. Um, moisturizing pads containing blue carotene from fresh carrot seed oil, plump cotton pads filled with moisturizing ingredients to hydrate and soothe the skin barrier. And um, the girl I watch, she, this is her favorite toner pads. Uh, and as I said, I've never used toner pads. So I'm really looking forward to trying these. Uh, oh, they are sealed. Um, but 
I think I'm going to, if I can close the lid. Um, I think I'm going to actually uh, get this to my bathroom cabinet. Um, but I'm, because I'm really looking forward to trying that. And then I have two items left and it is makeup. Um, let's start with this. This is the Holika Holika Jelly Dough Blush in Apricot Jelly. Uh, I have the Rose Jelly and the Grapefruit Jelly. It's one of my favorite formulas uh, of all time. I have not tried this yet. Uh, but it's a one-toned blush, really pretty. And then I fell for the uh, viral hype. Mm, this is the Tear Tear Mask Fit Red Cushion Foundation um, in 13N Fair Ivory and 17N Vanilla. I bought two because I'm not sure what color I am. Uh, so I bought the mini size and when I figure it out, I will buy a larger size, probably, if I like it. Um, let me swatch this, actually. Um, uh, it comes with one of those, and then you open this, and then you have to remove the seal. So this was 13N Ivory. Oh, that is really a lot. Mm. On my hand, it looks pretty uh, full coverage and kind of uh, light, especially in this. But I'm a bit more browner on my hands than I am on my neck. Uh, but this can work, definitely work. Um, and then let's see, 17N is vanilla. So let's open that. <clears throat> And it ob obviously has the same sticker. <laughs> um, so let's watch that. Oh, it, it's really filled with the product. Um, so this is 17N vanilla. Uh, this is not as bright as the other one. Uh, I do believe that the 17N is more correct of a color than the other one, but I think I can make both of them work. Um, and guys, that was everything. Um, as I said, I'm really looking forward to all of the th stuff that I've uh, purchased. I've already started to do use some of it in my hair. That is a mess today, sorry. Uh, <clears throat> and I do really love your style. I have a um, kind of a low buy situation going on now. Um, I'm just waiting for the two things that I accidentally buy, bought. And then, but I'm going to buy, I think I'm going to buy from Yesta. I think I'm going to try to get the advent calendar this year. I tried every time they released it last year and I missed out. So I'm not sure what's up with that. Uh, but I'm going to try to get it. Uh, and I'm also going, to, probably going to buy, do a Black Friday haul with Yesta because they have amazing prices. And when I buy on Black Friday, I stock up for a whole year. So yes, let me know in the comments down below if there's anything from my um, haul that you've tried or if there's anything you um, want me to talk more in depth about. Uh, thank you so much for watching. I do appreciate you. I do appreciate your views. I do appreciate your likes and comments. It's been low on that, but that's my fault. Uh, again, thank you so much for watching. Uh, until I make another one, please take care. Bye.